Charles Caldwell, May 14, 1772 to July 9, 1853, Louisville, Kentucky, was a noted 19th century US physician who is best known for starting what would become the University of Louisville School of Medicine. Topic: <laughs> Early life Charles Caldwell was born on May 14, 1772 in Caswell County, North Carolina. His parents were Irish immigrants. Caldwell earned an M.D. from the University of Pennsylvania School of Medicine in 1796 while studying under Benjamin Rush. Career <laughs> <laughs> Caldwell practiced medicine in Philadelphia and was a lecturer at his alma mater, the University of Pennsylvania. He also edited the Portfolio, one of the day's primary medical magazines, and published over 200 medical publications. Caldwell was elected a member of the American Antiquarian Society in 1815. A significant number of copies of Caldwell's 18th and 19th century publications, including copies of the portfolio, survive in the collections of the AAS. Other institutions holding original copies of Caldwell's publications include the United States National Library of Medicine, and Harvard's Francis A. Countway Library of Medicine. In 1819, Caldwell left Philadelphia to join the fledgling medical school at Lexington, Kentucky's Transylvania University, where he quickly turned the school into the region's strongest. In 1821, he convinced the Kentucky General Assembly to purchase $10,000 worth of science and medical books from France, many of which are still held at the university. Despite his success, his abrasive and arrogant Temperament created enemies at Transylvania. The university's medical program would fold soon afterwards. The school dismissed him in 1837, and he then traveled with several colleagues to Louisville, where they created the Louisville Medical Institute. As at Transylvania, he made the new school an instant success, with its rapid growth into one of the region's best medical schools. However, he was forced out in 1849 due to a personal rivalry with Lunsford Yandall. Caldwell was one of the earliest supporters of polygonism in America. Caldwell attacked the position that environment was the cause of racial differences and argued instead that four races, Caucasian, Mongolian, American Indian, and African, were four different species, created separately by God. Caldwell was one of the earlier of the U.S. physicians who argued for polygonism. His work was subsequently cited by Josiah Knott in Types of Mankind and he was followed by physicians such as Samuel Henry Dixon and John Edwards Holbrook. <laughs> Death Caldwell died on July 9, 1853 Louisville, Kentucky. Topic selected works An attempt to establish the original sameness of three phenomena of fever 1796, a semi-annual oration, on the origin of pestilential diseases 1799, an eulogium to the memory of Dr. Samuel Cooper 1799, medical and physical memoirs, containing, among other subjects, a particular inquiry into the origin and nature of the late pestilential epidemics of the United States 1801, an oration on the causes of the difference, in point of frequency and force, between the endemic diseases of the United States of America, and those of the countries of Europe 1802, an eulogium to the memory of Mr. George Lee 1802, an essay on the pestilential or yellow fever, as it prevailed in Philadelphia in the year 1805 1807, an anniversary oration on the subject of quarantines 1807, an eulogium on Caspar Wister, M.D., Professor of Anatomy 18 
1818 outlines of a course of lectures on the Institutes of Medicine 1823 elements of phrenology 1824 introductory address on independence of intellect 1825 thoughts on febrile miasms 1830 an address on the vice of gambling 1834 thoughts on the spirit of improvement the selection of its objects and its proper direction 1835 phrenology vindicated and antiphrenology unmasked 1838 autobiography of Charles Caldwell M D 1855